I'm Carissa Beal, and today we're going to be hitching with Tennessee Representative Mike Sparks. Why, hello. Hey. Hi. How are you doing? I'm good. Thanks for tracking your ride yeah, with Hitch Mike today. Sparks. Good nice to meet to you. you. Yeah. You look very handsome. Well, I appreciate it. It's one of my books I'd written called How to Do More with Lester in Tough Times, and um, that's one reason I'm a big fan of, of Hitch. Well, yeah. Because y'all are doing more with less. I would say, so how does Hitch fit into. How to do more or less? Yeah. Well, I think I, one area that I get upset with government is that we don't do the best what we can do. And y'all are being innovative. Um, uh, one reason I, I guess I got connected with y'all is people have heard me complain about the HOV lane. Mm -hmm. And some of the areas that I see the state can do better with. Um, and a, the HOV yeah. lane is something that, that I'm kind of passionate about. In fact, just this morning I was riding in and, and um, I'm passing the HOV lane. They're stuck in traffic. Mm -hmm. And the violation rate, I'll argue, is upwards of sometimes 90%. Well, this is really great. You're a doer. You, well, I try to be. Down, well, that's, you know, and that's what be. we're trying to be, yeah. I guess. What's your experience been like with the Nashville traffic? Well, I came up this morning at 7. I left at 7.40, I believe it was. And I, I take a, my commute is 23 and a half miles to the, to the parking garage at the state capitol. And um, coming up I-24, it gets it gets pretty congested, but it, it frustrates me. I mean, I've even had legislators pass me in the HOV lane. They pass me seriously, <laughs> and they're by themselves. And I I'm not going to do that because I'm violating the law. As a lawmaker, right. there's some hypocrisy there. Um, uh, Mark Cleveland and, and Hitch is, or they're probably the few lobbyists or the only lobbyists that's probably approached me about something innovative that that benefits the taxpayers, not costing the taxpayers. What I like about hitch and what y'all are doing you're doing something that's benefiting those that that could use some help once you try it you realize you know this actually does make your life easier and it can be more fun because you have yes, you know someone to talk to and it, it can just make the ride go by a lot faster and so yeah hitch is one of the yeah. ways that people in nashville really everywhere um, yeah. can start alleviating the traffic problem but what yes. are some other ways well, I tell you, we have to encourage people. The carrot and the stick approach, to me, it seems to work. You know, um, people are motivated by different ways. Some are motivated by money. Some are mo motivated by recognition and achievement. But I think people have to have a, a sense of purpose and, and, and belonging. Have you ever used any other forms of transportation? My sister works downtown, and I, I called her yesterday and called her last week when I'm leaving. And she she didn't use, utilizes. Um, the uh, the bus mm -hmm. system here in, in Davidson County. We'll go into Rutherford County, and uh, but ironically, the the bus, believe it or not, beat us back home of the day. Really? Yes, I was. Because yeah, people. I, when I've asked them, you know, well, why don't you take the bus? Oh, it takes too long. Yeah, the bus the bus literally beat us back home, and I I don't think it's my slow driving. <laughs> right. You know, but. I tend to want to play a game with the people that I'm driving around. Okay. Okay, are you down possibly? I'm, you're I'm good. You need to hear more about this game. So I'm good. maybe you've played it. Have you been being boozled? No, I did see one of your promos <laughs> about that. Yeah. So all it is is we're gonna cover some trivia questions. Okay. And then if you get them right, I eat one of these beans. And if you get them wrong, uh -oh. you eat one. Okay, so here's a question. What percentage of Nashvillians drive alone? 81.7, 80. I'm gonna say 80. I'm gonna say 80. Or 90.5. I'm gonna say 82 percent. Okay, so it's 81.7, but if we round up, up yes. I'm right. You're right, but you're also slightly wrong because it was 81.7. So hand me a bean too. We're okay, both gonna I'll eat. I'll get one. you this this brown right here. Okay, you're right. Okay. All right. <laughs> I'll take you up on it. I'm a good negotiator, ma'am. Yeah, I'm coconut. All right, I got lucky. My chocolate pudding. We're well, starting we both, off good. We both got lucky. We're starting off smooth. Yeah. In 2014, how many total public transit miles were logged? 78 million, 68 million, or 53 million? Oh my gosh. 53 million. Uh. You didn't get it. It was 68 million. Oh okay. 
I'm taking a chance here. You, you are. Yeah. I'm sorry right. about this. Mm. I mean, you would know dead fish you feel like. It must be strawberry banana. Yeah, because it's not that bad. You're yeah. not freaking out. No, it's pretty It's pretty decent. But throughout Nashville, how many HOV violation citations were written in 2016? <sighs> mm, not many. I'll put it that way. 162, um, 150, or 185? 150. 162. Oh, okay. Let's, let's try this again. Okay. <laughs> Maybe. This one I think is the same thing. What's that? What's yeah, that taste like? That's the dead fish. That one's for sure. So if you didn't get it the this first is time, a you rough did. One. I'm sorry. I, it is. That's it's bad. Right. HOV violation rate. I have counted literally. It was 100. percent If you think about it, if I counted 20 people, and it was, that's 100 percent violation rate. Yeah. So I mean, what's the point of even having one? Well, exactly, and that's what, you know, that's what I've kind of railed up here on the, on the house floor about the HOV lane, and oftentimes I feel like, you know, no one's listening, and I'm glad that, that Mark Cleveland and, and Hitch was apparently listening, mm -hmm. um, but, you know, if we can't manage what we've got, why do we want to go implement a tax increase when we're number two in the nation for infrastructure, you know, and, and people... A lot of my constituents are having a tough time. They're having a tough time with health care, a, a tough time with with um, uh, employment. And um, and I think Hitch can offer a, um, a viable solution. I mean, I hate to see, you know, folks, you know, my friends and, and get a ticket in the HOV lane, but um, if that can help induce people to carpool, knowing that there is some enforcement then I'm all about it. Doing what you can to alleviate traffic is really all we're asking. Well, my hat's off to, to Hitch and, and yourself and others that's Thanks. involved with your organization. So let's do one more bean. How all about right. it? Right. You up for it? I'm good. Okay. Tennessee has a total of how many miles of roadways? A, 84,367 miles. Okay. B, 104,658. Or C, 95,536. Let's go with A. It was C. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, one more C. bean for you, and then and then you get rid of me for the day. Bar, bar for, for peach. peach, okay. <laughs> yeah. You bar for peach. It's barf. Yeah, it's barf. That's not too good, man. Yeah, it's barf. I can kind of smell. Well, you've been a very good sport. Yeah. I love this. Yes, please read it. I'm, I'm going to. You I promise kinda, me. I, I promise you. Okay. Check this out. Um, if you guys will listen to this man and check out the links below, right? All right. Yes, folks. Listen to the look at the links below, and I'm thrilled to be here with Hitch. Start hitching your own ride today, and thank you for hitching a ride thank today. Thank you. Thank you. Chris. It's been a pleasure driving pleasure you. Pleasure. Anytime. Here. All right. Thank you. All right. All take right. care now. Thank you. We'll you too, you. Mike. Read the book now. I got it. Okay. Be good.